Shalawam, alright? I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. Double honor to the Yahweh of Great Millstone that rule well. They do rule well. Peace and blessings to the elect. Alright, the elect. Which is the 144 of Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. Who is going to be delivered? Come back down, which is New Jerusalem, coming back down out of heaven. The city, as a, as a, the, the city coming back down out of heaven, which is is the elect new jerusalem which is the times we're coming into very soon and we're going on to see that but it begins it begins with the elect so shall i want peace and blessings to the elect of yahweh bashami and uh as i say double honors to the apostles all right and uh, this is our one from the great millstone camp in trinidad uh go and do a video yahweh shai the son of the Mosai, Yahweh Shai. When he comes back, he coming back with fire, vengeance, and destruction to the wicked. Because he remembers perfectly everything that they do him back then. He remembers. This is a video from the brother Yashawamba page. Dallas camp leader. And um, the Dallas camp camp leader. And um, Shalawama. And, uh, the name of the movie I think is Color of the Cross or something like that. Color of the Cross. And I just I was watching Pisa from a video from the brother Kwadasha Part 4 page Shalawama. And I'm um, thinking the main camp in New York. Shalawama and um, that video was on the Hispanics and Native Americans are Israelites and in the end he did put where the son of the Mosai was on the cross. Now this movie showing you uh, uh, the this this one of the movies actually showing you the correct depiction of the son of the Mosai that he was a so called black man. Alright. So I wanted a little more meat from when they take him from the garden onto the cross, so I come on the brother Yashua on bus page because I saw it here on the brother Yashua on bus page and I watched it. And when I watched it, I, I in line, not trying to boast or anything, but yo, I, I shed tears because why? You see, what to do the son of man by you see, what to do the man by you kind of remembering too. It kind of coming in your, in your remembrance like that is what to do the man by. You know, so for that, Yahweh shy when he touched back down, when he comes back down from the spiritual realm into the physical realm, you fucking people who, 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 who Lord willing, I, Lord, hopefully I was in a part because we don't know we lot. Hopefully I was in a part of that. The men who, who touched that man. <laughs> Bye. I'll play the video. Judas. Thy Judas. Thy Judas. The devil. The son of perdition. The son of destruction. He. He. Come and kiss the Lord. And, tell the Lord and say Lord love you. With a kiss. Now that neck. The... I'll play the video. Time to meet your future, Nazarene. Let's go.
<laughs> no, <clears throat> no, just see this guy is who fall out of the shoot. You see, when you fall out of the shoot, yeah, ex yeah and, and, and then you want to come back in, yeah, you want your house shy to go through the same thing that he went through 2000 years ago, which he's not going to do. I'm gonna get a precept. That is really what you have a shy to do. You want him to come back on the cross and do what he did 2000 years ago. He's not going to do that. Not for you. <laughs> not for nobody as a matter of fact. This is Hebrews chapter 6 verse 4. And it says, For it is impossible for those who were once enlightened and have tasted the heavenly gift and were made partakers of the Holy Spirit and have tasted the good word of the Most High and the powers of the world to come, if they shall fall away to renew them unto repentance again, seeing they crucify themselves, the Son of Yahweh, afresh, and put him to an open shame. So, in order for you to, in order for you to get back the knowledge, after you leave it, it is impossible because you have a shy in coming back down for nobody and do this and go through this way you went through 2000 years ago. Hell no. And you non messianic Jews, you, you, you more stupid than any, you more docile than anybody else because, yo, who you could I believe the Messiah? He walked here, the man was here. Then why it have all this knowledge of him walking the earth? <laughs> it have all this knowledge of him walking the earth and he didn't walk the earth? All these people talking about he walked the earth, but he, he didn't walk the earth? No please.
all right um so you see now boy you have a shy and he comes back here boy and you have a shy returns boy thing gonna be pretty boy you fucking people who do demand that wicked act the just man the just man He just man, the man was a just man. He was no wicked man. Um is Revelation chapter one verse seven. Behold, he cometh with clouds. What is them clouds? Them clouds is so called UFOs. Alright? That is them clouds. He cometh with clouds. And every eye shall see him. And they also which pierced him. So that proves when he comes back here, he have you fuckers in his mind. You Romans and you Roman soldiers. You Roman soldiers who was wicked. You eat them, right? You've been wicked. You've been wicked. You've been wicked. You, you kill the just Lord. And they also which pierced him. And all kindreds of the earth shall wail. Because of him, all you go and wheel. When all you see him come back, oh my God, he come back. That is all you, that is all, that going to be all your facial expression. Oh my God, he come back. You from the time you have a shy crack them skies, boy. You going to know that a man ain't coming to play. See this time, this time around, he ain't coming to play with all you. He ain't coming to play with all you. Because he, he, he didn't play with Toilet the first time. But he did. But what he did, he didn't come as the warrior where he is because he's a warrior. He's a, he's a warrior. He's a warrior. Come in and read the scriptures. He didn't come in to just watch all that doing wicked, doing wicked this time. This time? No. Nah. No. Nah. Not this time. This time he come in to put it all there. You wicked fucking jakes and you wicked fucking um, Edomites. You wicked people, right? Let me read this. Um, it's First Corinthians chapter ten, verse nine. It says, neither let us tempt Yahweh Shai, as some also tempted, and were destroyed of serpents. So don't tempt the Lord. Don't tempt him. Neither murmur ye, as some murmured. As some of them also murmured, and were destroyed of the destroyer. Who is the destroyer? He's son of the Mosai. He ain't no puppy doll God. Scriptures call him the destroyer. <laughs> He is the destroyer. You know? That is the spirit where it passed through Egypt and smite the firstborn. Him. <coughs> so you people who do him? No. But the first time he did, he come as a lamb. Now this time he coming as no lamb. This time he coming as a, a, a force. You understand? Or he come as a lamb the first time. So you do him. Whatsoever all you listed. Whatsoever was listed all you doing. PSC side and all kind of thing. But hey, it was all prophecy. He finished it and eh, when he come back here, see when he come back here, he got he coming back at him. You have a shy coming back at him. Watching him. I eh, you have a shy coming back here on this earth. And I'm not joking. You see when he come back? Why? I just hope you have mercy on me because <laughs> you see boy yo <laughs> this is um Isaiah 47 verse 3 no no let me read from one it says come down come down who's the for in order for you to come down you have to be up in order for you to come down you have to be up and then I pull in your dome. Jacob handheld first the heel of Esau. 
for Esau is the end of the world. So Esau had to be up. And, G and somebody had to be pulling down the person who up. That is why Jacob's hand held first the healer Esau. That is why. You see? It says verse 1. Come down and sit in the dust. O virgin daughter of Babylon. Now the daughter of Babylon. The daughter of Babylon. Psalms 137 verse 7. It says remember O children. Remember O Yahweh the children of Edom. Now we all should know who Edom is. Edom comes from the Hebrew Adawam which means red. Scriptural reference to the red people. Genesis 25, 25. And the first came out red and they called his name Esau. And why he was why he was, was called red too, he did drink the red pottage. Pottage with blood. Half cup food. You understand? So it says, Remember, O Lord, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem who said, Erase it, meaning erase it. Like if you write something on a piece of paper and you erase it with a pencil. Like it have a pencil and it have a eraser at the end of the pencil. The tip. You write it and you want to erase where you write. That is how Esau wanted to erase Jerusalem. Erase it, erase it. Meaning waste it away, finish it, clean it out. Even to the foundation thereof, meaning they completely destroy them. O oh, daughter of Babylon, who art to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewarded thee, as thou hast served us, and you served, the un you served unjustly the just one. The just one is Yahweh Shai, and you served them unjustly. You understand? It begins with him. Does he come from the lineage of Jacob? He's a, he's a, he's one of, he's, he come in one of the sons of Jacob. He, he's one of the sons of Jacob in, in, the, in, the, in the flesh. When he walked in the flesh, he was one of the sons of Jacob. He come from Jacob line. Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, he was in the lineage of them. All the times in all reincarnations, he never come as no fucking Edomite. So you see that white image? You see that white image you pop as the son of the Mosai too? He saw you see that, but you have a lot to pay for. Huh? You have, hey, yeah, Baba Hashem, yeah, Baba go and deal with you, boy. I'm telling you, you're going to get, uh, you're going to get punished. Are thou he that shall altogether go and punish? No. He is not he that shall altogether go and punish. We've been punished. All right, the scriptures say in second, I believe second Chronicles somewhere there, if he if he sin, if he commit iniquity, he shall be beaten with the rods of men and with the stripes of men. I was talking about Yahweh Shai, as Solomon, he didn't go and punish. And think about it, because he did sin as when he was Solomon. Think about it. Didn't he create the earth? Yes, he did. He created heaven and earth by the order of his father. He was there. He knew that, and he went through all what he went through. So how the fuck you as you who, who who you? That means that means you had to be the man who tell yourself you is God. You ain't God. You is just a man. Ezekiel twenty eight. Ezekiel twenty eight. So. The daughter of Babylon is Esau, which is Edom, right? And then when you read back in Isaiah 47, it says, verse, verse, verse 1, Come down and sit in the dust, O virgin daughter of Babylon. So that means the, 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 the Esau or Edom had to be ruling, had to be on top in order for you to bring them down and put them in that state of confusion. No, America completely going to be a dust, a desert. And a desert is dust. Alright? That is what it means. America going to be completely destroyed. Come down and sit in the dust in a confused state. Right now, America in a confused state. That is Babylon. I give somebody to dust in your eyes. Wait, wait, you're going to be confused. You understand? 
and like somebody threw dust in his so-called white man eyes because he, he don't know how to rule he's just a f unfit ruler sit on the ground there is no throne O daughter of the Chaldeans, for thou shalt no more be called tender and delicate. Take the millstone and grind meal, uncover thy locks, make bare the legs, uncover the thigh, pass over the rivers. Thy nakedness shall be uncovered, meaning in other words, all the wickedness we, was been, we have been doing uncovering the top and having people looking at you as the light of the world. Somehow or the other, I going and be revealed that he is the devil. And how it being revealed? 2 Thessalonians chapter 2 verse 8 or 9 Who the Most High shall reveal with the spirit of his mouth The prophets Isaiah 25 verse 7 So in this mountain he will pull back the veil which is spread over all nations Alright the, the, the Most High know what he have been doing from the start And, 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 and what he do in Amos 3 and 7 Surely the Lord will do not but he reveal it his secret unto his servants the prophets now the most I have been watching you. We wasn't watching you 15, 20, uh, uh, 50, 60, 70 years ago. We wasn't watching you like that. Most I have been. And all these secrets, he revealed it unto his servants, the prophets. So we now know what you've you been doing. And the prophets now going outside on the highways and the byways as they are commanded to. You're not commanded to fucking be behind a computer all the day making videos you commanded to go outside there so Baloo guys like Baloo because yes I just go outside there twice a week not a boasting thing but we, we, we put in work because why you commanded to do that so guys like Baloo and them who just want to sit down behind the fucking computer all the time and make videos you have a or me or shire uh, uh, Shalak Rayam on you fucking demon. Um, it says, Thy nakedness shall be uncovered, yea, thy shame shall be seen. This is Yahweh Shai here. I will take vengeance and I will not meet thee as a man. He met you as a man the first time. This time, hell no. This time, this time around, this time around. You won't be able to do the man, the just one, the just one. You won't be able to do the just one. This. You won't be able to do the just one. This. You see this way doing the just one here. This time around, when he comes back, you ain't gonna be able to do him. This you wicked fuck. Sorry for my, sorry for my using obscene, right true boy, but hey, I telling you boy, these devils boy, these devils had to pay, they had to pay, I telling you, I don't know my lot, and if I was in there, doing that wickedness to that man boy, I had to pay boy, cause that man didn't do no wickedness boy, man didn't do no wickedness. Get his piece up here. My eyes make you get real. My eyes get pissed off by when I see things like that. By. You 
Isaiah, Isaiah 52 verse 6 it says behold my servant who is the Lord's servant this is a prophecy of the same man who you either might kill 2,000 years ago you wicked Edom, you wicked people shall deal prudently he shall be exalted and extolled and be very high as many as were astonied at thee his visage was so mad more than any man his form more than the sons of men his visage is what how they beat him how he face was what it do to the man it was so mad it had nobody he, he kind of licks the pawn that man and that just had to prove that was a so-called black man because either might can't take that kind of licks hell no so when you have so-called black man who could take that kind of licks and be strong still what shall we go through in slavery we take all kind of licks so it had to be a so-called black man taking that kind of legs. No, no, fuck, no, no, either might. You either might feeble and weak. So he says his visage was so mad more than any man and his form more than the sons of men. And because of that, because of that, he coming back for your blood. He is. He is. Isaiah 63 and 4, 63 and 1. It says, Who is this that cometh from Edom? Why Edom? Why are Hawashai coming from Edom? Because Edom is the ones who want to be ruling in the time when he come back on the earth. So who is the ones ruling in this time? You so-called white people is the Edomites. Just accept that line and saying that done away with 14,000 years ago, uh, Edomites was done away. They, they were not done away. They're still walking here today. Why it is Yahawashai coming from Edom when he comes back? Why does the prophecy state that? Because he's a prophecy on here. Why it's stating that when he coming back, he coming back from Edom. Because Edom going and be ruling when he comes back. So Esau is the devil. Right? With dyed with dyed garments from Bajra. I'm hurry up because if you go and close off just now. With dyed garments from Bajra. This is this that is glorious in his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength. I that speak in righteousness, mighty to save. That's your how shy. Wherefore art thou red in thine apparel and thy garments like him that treaded the wine fat? I have trodden the wine press alone, and for the peop and, and of the people there was none with me. For I will tread them in my anger and trample them in my fury, and their blood shall be sprinkled on my garments, and I will stain all my raiment, coming to do a great slaughter in all your, in all your, in America. It says, For the day of vengeance is in my heart. The day of vengeance is in my heart. So he come in for vengeance on you Edomites, for piercing him, for beating him, for, for giving him piss to drink, for uh, 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 kneeling him to the cross, Putting crowns that turn on his head, having him walking through the streets, beating him, doing him all of that, and doing his people that afterward, from since the time of the Greeks, yo, you going and feel it. A thousand years of slavery and burning. A bonfire after that. Esau, we're going to have a bonfire with Esau in, in the kingdom of heaven. After a thousand, after he done build up, we kingdom. Which is just just it's just justice. Second Thessalonians one and sixteen it is a righteous thing with the most high to recompense tribulation to them that trouble thee. It's just justice, yo. That is all done not done nothing to do with just justice. You do it, so we had to be it had to be done unto you. What goes around comes around. And with that I would say shallow woman barakataya wabba shame or shy. Hopefully this was edifying. Hopefully. Till the next time, I will try coming back with vengeance. Shalom.